guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another episode of Patriot Living. Um, we're gonna get back into some uh, some of this game here. Um, we're gonna do the Subnautica Sub Zero. I think it's called Sub Zero, <laughs> whatever. Um, but uh, we're gonna go ahead and get into it. Um, I do have it playing in the background, so it's kind of messed with me. I know you guys don't hear it, but I can hear it in the background. So, and that's what I'm hearing. Ha ha ha. All right, guys. So let's go ahead and get into it. Um, sorry about last the last video because I know you couldn't hear it. I could barely hear it. But everything's working now. All right. So I need to figure out how to make this thing again. Okay. So I know we went out and, and, and farmed a bunch of stuff. All right, let's go ahead and go and get some stuff here. I need to go get some of this ribbon, uh, this ribbon plant. I'm not sure exactly where to find it. I know we've probably found some last time we were on. I think. No, I guess we didn't. I think I found some but didn't pick it because I couldn't I didn't I couldn't remember how to pick it. Oh cool, it does give you that. Aurora Borealis, that's cool. Here's the Aurora Borealis. I do kind of like the I like the music more on this one, honestly. There we go. There's one. New creature discovered. New creature discovered. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Yay, progress.
No. Lubricant. So we need. Yeah, we do. Okay. I'm going to deposit this stuff in here. Uh, what do I want to deposit in there? I really don't have anything I can. That's okay, we'll do that, 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 that. For now. Alright. <laughs> Let's get to the creep vines again. So, so far, so good. It's an okay game, I think. I think it actually runs better than some, the original Subnautica. Uh-oh. What happened? I just got froze by what? What did I get froze by? know in the comments what the hell that was that, that froze me that was just weird Oh no. Some of the wildlife down here is very grabby. No, 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 no. How do I get that? Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. I still have it. Yeah, he still has it. Thank you. <clears throat> oh, you dick. Little bastard, little sea monkey grabbed my shit. Little dickhead. Let's 
So this time we're not here to save the planet. We're here to figure out what the hell happened to your sister. Let me tell you, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not excited to find out. It sounds terrifying. Just in case I need more later. transportation device used for high-speed free diving contains a built-in light and map crystalline sulfur is the only thing I need huh it's all right for now There it is. <laughs> now bear with me guys, I don't know where the hell I'm going, so... Swimmy, 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 swimmy.
Did I come from this way? I don't know, maybe. I might have. Yeah, there's my stupid pod. I went that way, let's go this way. You wormy worm, yeah. Okay. So that's like an endless loop that goes everywhere and it does nothing. Do, 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 do. Woo, 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 woo. Sure, we got at least enough battery here. All right, well, Top side for a second.
Those are really cool. I like those. Titan hole fish. The fuck is that? That's the dude that shot me with the frost. That's kind of cool. Kind of cool, but not cool. Lead. I don't really have anything I can build that needs Oxygen. lead. Uh, so I know there's some stuff up there. I think it's up there. I need to do too. Well, we finally got our sea glide. I'm hesitant to go that way. <laughs> Okay, let's 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 go take a look and see what we can see. Look at that. This sounds even more monotonous down here. What the hell? Warning. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. What is that? Oh, even better. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. Let's go. Need oxygen. O2. Need a bigger tank. <laughs> Take risks. Well, there's one thing to the uh, to the mobile vehicle bay. Stress call. Transmission of unknown origin. Source of transmission depth calculated at approximately 200 meters. Those are. Those are new. I've never seen that before. Unfortunately, there's no fast tracking this one, so. Don't know exactly where to go because I've only seen it played like once or twice. And that was by by strategy, by the way. I did that strategically because I knew where to go on Subnautica. But on this one, I really don't. Picked up what sounds like a distress call. Who or what is out here calling for help? Didn't sound human. Huh. Maybe it's from a remnant of architect technology. In her message, Sam's colleague did say there was something important here. Even if it's just a mimic from one of the more intelligent aquatic specimens, that could be a major find. 
or if it's from Altera, it could have bearing on what happened to Sam. I should definitely check it out. Picked up what sounds like a well, right? Who or what is out here calling for help? Didn't sound human. Maybe it's from a remnant of architect technology. In her oh, message, Sam's doing? colleague did say there was something important here. <laughs> Even if it's just a minute Sorry. from one of the more intelligent aquatic specimens, I was a little nervous about dropping into an unknown area. But luckily, this biome seems to have an abundance of minerals I can use for tools and upgrades. I didn't want another situation like Byzantos 5. When Xenoworks dropped me off, there were barely any resources. I survived off the land for three months with just a knife, my lucky PDA, and some rope. I am still kind of proud of that, though. <laughs> I would be too, girl. I would be too. Some of the wildlife down here is very grabby. If I didn't know better, I'd say they're after my supplies. No, well, there's nothing. In goes a battery and titanium. Now comes a scanner. Every xenobiologist's favorite tool. This planet has some fascinating flora and fauna, and I can't wait to learn about them. This will also give me access to a greater tool set. I'm assuming Altera left behind tech that I can scan for blueprints. That should make surviving and exploring out here a bit easier. Don't worry, Sam. I haven't forgotten I'm here for you. But it can't hurt to do a little research on the side, right? I know you would have done the same. I will find out what happened to you. I promise. Yeah. I'm telling you, Sammy, you see some weird things when you spend half your day in a sea truck. More vandalism? Was it the sea monkeys again? I don't think so. Well, I can't shake the feeling this planet is cursed. Pretty much. <laughs> There's no such thing as a curse. Yeah, you're probably right. That's nothing. You wouldn't want to hear about it anyway. Just a huge creature frozen in ice. What? Where? In a cave. Not far from your lab. And here's the extra weird part. As soon as I called it in, they closed off the area. Don't want anyone going in there. But why? Sammy, I'm no biologist, but I think there was something wrong with it. Its skin just seemed off. Alien. An alien on planet 4546B. No. I'm serious, Sam. Something ain't right. <laughs> Wish I could show you, but I can't get back in there. You can. But I might know how to. Whatever you're thinking, we never had this conversation. What were you into, Sam? <laughs> okay. So, apparently, we are on the hunt for her sister, Sam. And we need to figure out what's going on with her and what's going on on the planet because, you know, not, not, not everybody is as smart as Sam and this chick, so... Dang, girl, dang. So, we're going to save here. And we're going to end the video. I want to thank you guys so much for, like always, coming out and watching me play. Um, I know this has kind of turned into a gaming channel. didn't really want it to be like that, but... Let's just say that... Um, some of the summer activities are coming together and I will be going outside and doing stuff, so that'll be on the channel here soon. Oh and look, look, I shaved. You see my chunky face. <laughs> Alright guys, but I'm gonna get on and out of here. As always, I love you. And uh and, uh have a great day. Uh be stay frosty, love ya.